We are out here at the Coronation property. Got a little snowfall today. This is a power line right of way here. And right behind me, you have the Coronation showing, which is a 20 meter wide quartz vein exposed out here. And it is between 12 and 20 meters exposed inside the adit. We got J2 up there taking a sample. We just took some samples from inside at a couple areas and we'll go show those after. Uh, he's gonna grab another sample up there right now. We also took some samples from this area here. This is presumably the dump material because there's no dump around here and I don't know where else they would have put it, but this is mineralized with molybdenite pyrite and minor calcopyrite. So we'll walk up just to the entrance here. This is a 91 meter at it. Opens up into a little stoped room. Right in the middle there's a shaft that's water filled. There's a cross cut to the left and then it continues on a little ways, 91 meters total. And as you can see, giant quartz vein. We got a sample here from J2. You can see quartz with molybdenite, bit of pyrite. I'm gonna wash it off a bit here in this gross water. So that's just right off the outside. You can see this along here, that's actually sericite, Vuggy quartz, mostly molybdenite in here. So, we are going to head back to where we stored our samples take a look at a few of the samples. All right, so this is our dump material that we took from the boulder. See molybdenite, a bit of pyrite, a little bit of calcopyrite. So we took these all from a big boulder inside the dump. And now these are from the outside where J2 is up there hammering away, you can see coarse pyrite. A lot of mineralization in the, the vugs of the quartz. And this is all molybdenite up there. And this is the first sample that he hammered off and threw to me. And this sample here is from 10 meters in the mine. All these samples have a combination of molybdenate pyrite with minor calcopyrite. You have some big, big vugs inside the mine. 10, 20, 30 centimeters wide, and they have just loose pyrite with minor calcopyrite in them. These are all from the same spot. 10 meters in. Malachite staining there. This is the last piece we took from the 10 meter mark inside the mine.
and this is 25 meters in similar mineralization This is the last sample here. And we have our little room, little stoped area with the shaft. This is from inside there on the wall, roughly 50 meters in. In this room, you have lots of bugs with lots of coarse pyrite. And the last sample from this specific area inside our little stoped room. And our last sample area is close to the contact of your granodiorite and quartz. And this is in the crosscut. So there's really no historic documentation on this other than in the 80s, a prospector following the power line right of way found this at it. And that's pretty much it. No sample assay results, nothing. And this is our final sample from the crosscut. Last little piece. A pretty interesting little area, not a bad little prospect, and we are going to keep chugging away here. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.